Hey guys, for today's video, we are gonna be doing another holiday update. If you didn't see my last one, I'll link it right here, but let's go ahead and get started. So this is gonna be my last video of the year and then I'll post again next year. I'm still gonna post shorts until the end of the year, but actual video, this is my last one for 2023. This updo is so easy. You literally just need bobby pins, a hair tie, that's it. Make sure your hair is brushed. Make sure it doesn't need to be clean. It doesn't even need to be curled. So we're just gonna leave out some hair here in the front like I always do. You could slick it back if you wanted to. If I sound sick, it's because we have been we have been sick, okay? We have all had it around here. We are ready for a new year. This year has been busy, it's been hard, and we're just ready. So I'm gonna put the rest of my hair back into a ponytail. If you liked my last update, you'll like this one too. Um, it's just as easy. You guys know, when Lainey says easy, it is easy, okay? So easy, a caveman could do it. Let me turn around and let's do the video. All right, so you just want to split your hair in half. You're, <coughs> sorry. <coughs> You're going to take your top section, twist it around your finger. Does not matter which way you twist it. You could twist it away from your face, towards your face. It does not matter. All right, just twist it. Then you're just gonna bring it up around the bun, like this, okay? And you're just gonna bobby pin it. So let your ends just kind of naturally fall down and then stick a bobby pin or two into place. Just like that. I've done a video on how to use bobby pins, but just as a reminder, make sure you're using heavy duty, bobby pins like this one right here. This is Metagrip. Make sure when you are inserting your bobby pins, they are down like this, ridges down, and then insert like this. You don't really want to open your bobby pin like this. Um, just leave it like that and insert it. Now we are just gonna split the remaining ponytail into two equal sections. We're gonna do the same thing. We're just gonna twist that section of hair around our finger, just like that, super easy. Now with this twist, you're actually gonna bring it right above that twist we just did. And then hold on to it, let the ends fall. Stick your bobby pins right into that new twist. Okay, just like that. So, so far we have two twists, one, two. Now when you get to the ends, you guessed it, you're gonna twist them around your fingers, just like this. And make sure you're twisting up towards the top too. So twist at the top all the way down. Then you're just gonna twist, twist. <laughs> then you're just gonna take that twist and you're gonna do the same thing, bringing it under and around. So just loop it around under. Then with any ends hanging out, you just kind of tuck them up under the bun. So up under so they're hidden. Just bobby pin. Super easy. Now you might just kind of want to turn your bun a little. Um, if it doesn't feel secure, which it should feel pretty secure, you could kind of fix that a little bit. Now one thing I like to do with my updos, literally always if you've been following me, is pinch and pull. This gives you the look of curling your hair without curling your hair. It makes it look like you have so much added texture and I just, I love that. Here's my fingers. You are just gonna take little sections of hair, hair with your nail and just pinch and pull, pinch and pull. Here's my nails. I'm just taking the smallest section, pinching and pulling, pinching and pulling, pinching and pulling, pinching and pulling, doing this all around. Pinching and pulling. Again, these are tiny sections and you are just barely lifting them up. And make sure you do this all around your head. As I'm filming this, my kids are starting to come in. They're saying, come on, mom. Time to hang out with me. See, just by doing that little bit, how much texture that added. So I'm just gonna go around and where I miss spots, just do it again. You can kind of fluff out your bun. Um, if you want a fuller, make sure it's nice and symmetrical. And that is pretty much it. So I'm just taking some big sexy dream catcher hairspray. 
and just kind of throwing it on top, smoothing out any flyaways. That is it. That is the video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment. Thank you guys so much for all of your support now, throughout the years. Thank you for being here. It truly means the world to me. I love doing videos for you guys. More to come in 2024. I wish you guys a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Love you. Mwah.